And they did that press conference actually here in Otay Mesa. We're on Bayer Street. You can actually see some of the repavement process that's being done here. Crews were here since 8 this morning. Now, this street was scored one of the lowest grades because of its poor conditions. Um, actually, a lot of people were complaining about this street, so we're actually seeing some progress now. We were able to get an update from Mayor Todd Gloria about where the repairs are in the San Diego roads. Take a listen. We created this in-house team of our transportation department to fix more roads across the city faster. And as I travel around our city each week, the quality of our roads is one of the most frustrating things that I experience as your mayor. I drive on these streets too, and I certainly hear the same frustration from so many San Diegans. That's why we've made road repair a huge priority in our budgets. And so Mayor Todd Gloria joined District 8 Council Member Vivian Moreno and other city leaders to give an update on road repairs. They highlighted repaving Bayer Way and celebrated how since the beginning of Mayor Gloria's administration, they have repaired over 1,600 miles of roadway. The city says it has focused on prioritizing streets that are heavily traveled. Although there's significant progress, there's still a lot of work that needs to be done. In fact, according to their most recent assessment, only about one in five San Diego roads are in good condition. Their new pavement management plan cited the need to invest $188 million annually over the next eight years to increase conditions of city streets to a satisfactory level. With an additional $4.8 billion in investments over the next five years, the city could be able to upgrade and modernize most of its infrastructure, including streets. So back out here, uh, here in Otay Mesa, for people who drive on this street, it is some good news. Uh, as I mentioned before, there was a lot of uh, people who live here who go to work and have to pass by this street. They noticed the poor conditions, and so seeing some progress here is definitely a step in the right direction for the city of San Diego and the people here in Otay Mesa. But right now, it is about a three-mile stretch that they are repaving. They'll be out here for the next couple of hours. That's latest here in Otay Mesa. I'm Regina Rita, CBS 8.